Hey guys, Ruby Master Sun here and welcome back to another video. So today in this video, we are going to be talking about the new Frisians. Obviously, they have yet to come out, so I don't really have all of the facts about them, but I'm just going to be talking about what I've seen from the Star Stable Instagram. Star Stable has been releasing a lot of spoilers about them. This includes the main, the new bridles, and the actual model of the Frisian, which I don't know about you guys, but I've really been enjoying Star Stable releasing these behind the scenes because it gives us an idea of what they're doing. Doing. And I think that Star Stable genuinely does listen to us as much as people would like to not admit. I do think that Star Stable listens to their community. And by doing these behind the scenes things, it's giving us an inside look as to how difficult it actually is to make a horse. But anyways, that's besides the fact. Star Stable recently uploaded a picture on their Instagram of the new bridles. And they had us vote on which ones we like best. I'll put all of them up on screen right now. And tell me down in the comments below which one you prefer. I personally like the second one but i also really like the third one because of the horns i think that's really cool i've never seen star stable make anything like that and it really matches the medieval theme so i'm kind of torn between two and three i think they should release all of them but of course that could be a little bit difficult in terms of coloring and stuff but like i said i like all three of them so maybe they will release all three i'm not sure but i do want to give a little bit of a disclaimer before i talk about these frisians i do not know all of the facts i'm just going off of what i've personally seen i haven't seen any of the other videos about this or anything so i'm just going to be giving my opinion so as you guys know the frisians have already been updated and i do not think that they were updated to match in real life frisians i think they were updated to create a better version of the old one hence why they're being updated again to actually be realistic this time while the other ones were kind of just a new and improved look-alike of the older ones because they are a classic horse frisians used to be the horse to have back in the day along with andalusians which they both had the same look and now that andalusians are updated it's definitely time for frisians to get an update as well so a picture will pop up on the screen of what the model will end up looking like of course it is a work in progress so this is not the final model but it's a little bit of a snippet into what it may look like in the future i really like it i think it looks just like in real life frisians i love how long the mane is hopefully they will give an option to make it shorter for those who aren't a big fan of long manes because there are people like that out there i don't know how they don't like long manes but they're out there they're monsters just joking okay but anyways like i was saying i really do like this model i like how long the manes are and they're even offering like curly styles and braided manes and stuff i think this horse is going to be a big success and i'm definitely saving up my star coins for them right now i'm still saving up for the new yervik wild horses but hopefully i will have enough for the frisian in the future i think that these horses are going to be absolutely beautiful they might even be up there with the lusitanos which is my favorite horse they definitely have the capability of doing so I am wondering though what their special gait is going to be because most dressage horses have special gates, if not all of them. So I would assume that the Frisian would have a special gait as well. There is one that I've been thinking about that Lipizaners do. However, I do believe that Frisians are capable of doing it as well. And it's the high jump in the air where they kick out. They used to use in war. I'm not sure exactly what it's called. So I was wondering since they are doing these medieval bridles, it is a possibility that that could be its special move. I think that would be very very exotic. We've never had a horse do something as crazy as that. However, these new Yervik wild horses are a little bit out of our special move comfort zone by laying down. So I think it is a possibility that Star Stable will do something as crazy as the high jump. But I am personally super excited to see what Star Stable has to offer with this horse. I think it's going to turn out amazing. It's going to be beautiful and I am definitely getting my hands on one of them. I don't know which colors are going to come out yet, but I know one of my personal friends, Anya Firepole, released a couple of recolors, which I'll put up on the screen as well once again full credit to Anya I'll put her Instagram in the description below so that you guys can check her out as well but she had some really good concepts and I would for sure buy some of these obviously they're gonna have black because black is a typical Frisian color but I wonder what kind of sports horse colors they're gonna be if they're gonna bring back old ones or if they're gonna release new ones or like have a combination of both I think that the main three colors that they're gonna do is obviously black maybe white and then the blanket one because that is a household favorite. Everyone in Star Stable loves that one and you'll still see them running around every now and then. Oh, it looks like there's something going on over here. Call me crazy, but I really enjoy that type of stuff. Like flat and show jumping shows on Star Stable is like one of my all-time favorite things to watch and do. But that is besides the point. Back to Frisians. It hasn't been decided yet when the Frisians will actually come out, but it should be sometime soon because they're already working on the special bridles. So I think that could be a sign that they're coming out very 
very soon. I would assume that they wouldn't release them quite yet, just because we still are waiting for the second batch of Yurvik Wilds. But Star Stable does have a tendency to release horse after horse, so you never know when they're going to be coming out. I mean, they could be coming out three weeks from now. We have no idea. All I know is that I'm super excited to see them, and I really, really want one already, and all I've seen is the gray model of it. That's when you know a horse is going to be good. There have been a couple of other assumptions of things that are going to be coming out, such as more pets and possibly updated reindeer for Christmas, which I think would be awesome because the current reindeer are really weird looking. Of course, I'm sure reindeers are the least of their priority considering this is a horse game, not a reindeer game. But I still think it'd be really cool if they updated the spells that you could turn your horse into a reindeer for. Maybe make it so it's more horses than just the star horse because it can be a little bit annoying having to go grab it. But I'm also just lazy. I'm sure no one else has that big of a problem. All I know is that I personally have been super satisfied with Star Stable's recent updates and their new horses. I think they've been stepping up their game and they deserve all the credit that they can get. These Frisians will be a huge success and I am super excited for the next updates to come. And of course the mobile version, which I will be trying out when it actually comes out for US. Hopefully it'll be soon because I cannot wait to be in the middle of class playing Star Stable. I'm joking, do not do that, you'll get in trouble. But it's still a cool concept and that'll definitely help people like my sister for example who doesn't have a laptop to be able to make videos on mobile would be a huge help for them and it'll release a whole new world for star stable youtube including a lot of new creators so i cannot wait to see that i am very excited for the future of star stable i know some people have been hating on it possibly being boring or something like that but i think that it's been getting better every day and i don't mean to kiss up but i really do feel that way and i hope that you guys do too but anyways i think that's going to be the end of this video i just wanted to talk a little bit about the new Frisians and how excited I am for them personally. There are a lot of ideas and concepts going around, so you guys can always go check that out on other people's channels or Instagrams. And if you do want to check me out on Instagram, it's ruby underscore master sun. I like to post events and just random star stable pictures, so I think you guys would really enjoy that. But anyways, like I said, that's going to be it for this video. I do hope to release more content, so be sure to subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!